So we're at the herb spiral today, and this will be a continuation of the permaculture economics here. Um, this is cilantro. Cilantro is that delicious herb that goes in all your Mexican food. You can't have a good salsa without cilantro. And this has gone to seed. We like cilantro too because it's a nice uh, companion herb. It uh, repels a lot of stuff like uh, cabbage worms and uh, tomato worms and things like that. So what we're going to do with this, this was one single cilantro plant. And we'll just take it over here. In the regular economy that we're all accustomed to is an economy of scarcity. It's one that forces us into competition with one another. One of the uh, Dominican sisters by words is to make peace. Uh, so one of the things that permaculture does is biomimicry. It tries to imitate nature. The human economy is controlled from the top by the most powerful with a so-called trickle-down, enough to keep everybody uh, in line. But again, we all have to compete for the same scarce resource, and in our society, that's dollars. We need money, because everybody has to use money. We don't make our own stuff anymore. We use money to get everything, because money accelerates the pace of exchange. But it's scarce, and when there's scarcity, that means we're in competition with one another. We're in competition with one another for jobs, if you're in a Nonprofits, you're in competition with someone else for a grant and so forth, and competition uh, engenders conflict. Nature, on the other hand, has an economy that's based on abundance. It always makes lots more than we need for everything because that's um, the way it perpetuates itself and, and creates this wonderful biodiversity. So here we have one cilantro plant and what we're going to do is get right here on top of this, and you can come up and see, just put a paper towel down here. I'm just going to work these guys off. And we'll see, when we talk about abundance, what we're talking about here. This is one cilantro plant, and each one of these is another cilantro plant with just as many seeds as this one. Now. We haven't even, we haven't gotten but about a fraction of the seeds off that one plant so far. But as we can see, we have a lot more plants. So, now, I said we go back and do this again, but I don't know, I'm not much at math, but I'd guesstimate there's probably well over a thousand seeds in there. Uh, maybe even more than that. That's from one plant, so it's one times a thousand. When you have abundant resources, when your economy is based on abundance, everybody has enough, then you have a much lower potential for conflict. That's why we say this is both permacul permaculture economics and peacekeeping.